Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Gameplay, and today I am playing more of Assassin's Creed for Black Flag. Now, as you can see, I am making my way to a mission, and also in the meantime, enjoying the parkour element of this game. And now, I thought, you know what? There are some guards here, why not kill them? You know, I'll get used to the combat a bit more, I'll get better at it. I don't really know why the civilians help you, because I've done nothing for them. I, absolutely nothing. But, you know, as long as they do something uh, that benefits me, I'm not gonna question it, I'm just gonna accept it. Sometimes it gets a bit fecky because you know it just gets stuck on a um, ledge and he doesn't want to go up like there for a little bit and you're just sitting there like just trying to get up but him not wanting to and now there's going to be a cut because um, well I didn't want to include all of it because it was quite a while getting there by doing just doing parkour and so yeah I included this part because this is where I get a shanty and cons uh, compared to Valhalla these shanties are really easy to get even though I fell into the water but I still got it I think, yeah, no, 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 I still, I still got it, yeah. But in Valhalla, you have to study everything to see where you have to go to, because it's not laid out for you, you can't really see the path. There are, in Valhalla, you can just climb on anything. And, uh... If um, you can climb on anything and the um, city is just full of things, you don't really know where you have to go. And so you just get lost and the tattoo gets replaced. You, lo you lose it. We'll see what happens. And now, to not push you through all the suffering that I had to endure, I cut out most of it because I kept getting detected and um, they were moving too fast so I lost them. And this happened for at least 7 times, not counting this one. And so it's going to be a cut uh, somewhere. A bullet! I think two minutes about there later perhaps we should split up to confuse them best idea you had today you know here I saw an opportunity and of course I took it But to, to get this clear, I would always choose Assassin's Creed Unity um, Unity's parkour over anything. It doesn't matter how polished it is, Unity is still the king when it comes to parkour. Especially when you get stuck. Getting stuck is just annoying more than anything. This would be Captain Mendoza? Yes, sir. He's very excited to meet you. Only you must be present for a, a, a hanging. A yard. Hanging? 
Ah, a little bird hanging. Yes, sir. Very nice. If we hear the bell, we may go, if you like. And also that, uh, not being able to jump down to these ledges. That was infuriating, to say the least. Just jumping from one ledge to another. And that was the cut. Because in between those moments, there was a lot of suffering and... Uh, well, I don't wish that upon anyone, to be honest. Because I don't know if it's the game's fault that it's so old and the missions are like this, but it's extremely hard for no reason. And like, they just randomly look up and see me. Why would you look up? You have a path to go to, you have to be there on time. But you randomly just you know, lift your head up and see me telling you. And I might not even be telling you. I may just be doing that for fun and I just happen to be there. that was just far enough to not be uh, in the eaves eavesdrop uh, like position and that's good enough how can you feel any hear anything f from that distance they must be shouting one another one another it doesn't make any sense Things I can sell, tobacco, rum, sugar. Because if you're discussing illegal or like, uh, you know, villainous plans, you shouldn't be shouting on the street. And these poses are so awkward. Look at that. Very kind. Start. And another yeah, five second pause. Why are they here? End of the video is here. I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you on the next one as well. Captain Have a nice day.